Hello students. Uh, I'm sure you all keep fine. Um, this class is the continuation of the previous class. Okay, mother's voice. Vasil Bresno is the author of this topic. Okay, supplementary of sixth unit. Fine. Then let's quickly evoke the previous class. What was the previous class? Uh, son and mother were talking through the video call. Okay, over the phone. Here, the sun is in the other planet, in the moon, right? Mother is in the earth, right? They were talking. Uh, actually, this is what the last call of the sun, okay? Sun is planned to move next star, okay? Next planet. Uh, this he didn't reveal to his mother because she worries. That's why uh, he wasn't revealed this um, expedition which means travel to another planet another star right uh, then while talking he called and he just through the call you know he's showing the uh, moonscape of uh, this land okay so by seeing all these things this mother you know uh, she was uh, delighted overwhelmed happy by seeing the landscape of this moon okay uh, then by seeing this moonscape then she admired the beauty of this land then you know uh, mainly he was in the tunnel of selenopolis actually uh, that is a city of the moon it's a fictional story okay imaginary story so in this moon you know there was a city uh, tunnel selenopolis named selenopolis so he shows the tall uh, structures buildings everything okay so by seeing this mother you know she wanted okay then um, then when he he just listening her voice okay actually she sings well her voice uh, so very sweet okay when he was child he knows since his childhood okay uh, this holiday center she is so happy and sings well at the same time uh, this weekend you know weekend uh, she she's quite happy but on the other days you know she is very busy with the household things household choirs okay choirs mean household task then she muted right mm, then you know uh, her voice also sings song manner it's quite fine then um, in return uh, she, so he shows all the some places of this moon she happy then she also uh, talk about the orchard of her house okay in the earth um, orchard meaning plant fruits plant okay fruit of uh, trees fruit trees trees of the fruit okay fruit trees so uh, these and all she she is talking about the orchards and uh, uh, different kinds of fruits everything then she is calling okay when will you come at least will you come for the summer uh, like that she is she is longing to see him okay so she is asking when will you come uh, like that but actually he cannot come right this is what the last call also uh, he planned to move next planet, right? Next star. Uh, but she doesn't know this. Uh, she's calling. She's longing to see him. Um, see, in the if we compare moon and earth, earth is the beautiful planet, right? Actually, uh, we have to live in this earth only, right? In the moon, you know, we cannot. Uh, we don't get any um, any plants or uh, fruits different food or anything it's just empty land right even people also there is no relationship no plants no beauty uh, nothing right uh, no water at the same time if we take here to see it's a beautiful planet right but this young you know they are not ready to enjoy our own planet their curious mind to move to next to next to planet right they are uh, searching things from other planet then when they reach that planet again they try to shift to another that adventures they filled with adventures right they are not ready to enjoy where they are clear yes so here you know they were talking and she is calling again uh, then he uh, 
he come to say this, this is what our last call I plan to move, other star, uh, but he stopped, okay, checked himself, checked meaning stopped himself, he didn't really, he just changed the topic, okay, well, he, because he, he, he doesn't want to make her worry, he reluctant to make her worry, that's the only reason, do you get, this is what the previous class we have seen, okay, shall we move next, page number 171, okay, then, it's, to, it's easy to walk here, he said, but the distance are so long, okay, so he says, uh, mom, it's quite easy to walk on this moon, okay, uh, but it's quite distance, far places, we need to walk uh, long, distance is too long, Selenopolis occupies more than 100 square kilometers, the city, you know, Selenopolis, there was a big tunnel, okay, so this tunnel, if we want to reach, we need to walk a lot, right? It, uh, nearly 100 square kilometer. Then let's ride for a bit. So this tunnel also very long one. So uh, he's asking, yes, let's take a ride in this tunnel. Fine. It's easy to walk here, he said. But the distance are long it's far okay too long selenopolis occupies tunnel actually in that town big tunnel is there okay more than 100 square kilometers more than 100 square kilometers let's ride for a bit a moving pavement covered with the green plastic stripes in this tunnel you know there was a moving pavement moving like a lift you know so it moves moving pavement uh, it's covered with green plastic stripes, rushed them through echoing tunnels and spacing cave, spacious caves. It has enough space, okay, it's enough space in this tunnel with the walls sparkling in the light of squat slam. In this tunnel, you know, inside is filled with the dark, right? So they fixed a lamp on the wall, squats lamp on the wall. It's a flickering, okay? So it, enough, it has enough space and lamp also, squats lamp. And they are moving uh, in this moving payment, okay? Because it's too long, clear? Then the elevator delivered, uh, delivered them to the surface. This elevator you know escalator it's delivered to the surface at last they arrived at the, the surface she looked in silence at the enormous lily shaped tent there was a tent okay it's a huge tent enormous one a lily shaped tent by seeing that she wondered okay uh, now over a crater that was at least a kilometer in diameter that much it's a big one okay by seeing this uh, tent lily shaped tent she wanted got it then that place named the community of nation square that place you know that lily uh, tent you know lily shaped tent that place named community of nation square he told her so these are the things he is showing through call and talking about this. He is saying the name of this place. Clear? Then, told her, people of different nationalities who work in Selenopolis. See, Selenopolis in that big city, lot of people were working. So after their work, you know, uh, national who work in Selenopolis, who come here after work. So after work, they come here in this place. And there are some tourists, tourist people also there in this city. They are walking towards the lake. See that lily shaped tent you know it's like a mall uh, we here we go for malls right beach mall center for our uh, relax entertainment similarly here the city uh, there was a lily shaped tent in that tent a big waterfalls there so uh, in this place maximum people gathered after their work tourist people are there working people also there clear then um, tourists they they are walking towards the lake it's quite an exotic yes they walk towards the lake and it's quite exotic exotic means somewhat uh, delighted okay exciting happy experience to have swim on the moon yeah so he is explaining this place okay 
that lily shaped tent mode and uh, it's quite nice it has waterfall it's quite beautiful place all the people gather here they, are, they enjoy here these are the things he shares with his mother okay so immediately his mother says i'm sure it's better in the river nipar when you come to the earth for your holidays yeah here is a river okay nipar river actually this nipar river you know major river of europe it flows through the russia okay this river is better than what you are saying okay this uh, lake so river river is far better than this lake in the moon so when you will come here if you come in this holidays we can enjoy here like that see the mother you know trying to uh, she is describing she is talking about the beauty of the earth okay so make him understand the beauty of the earth people are not ready to enjoy our land right he is talking about the moon nothing is there right but our earth only filled with beauty uh, first need to learn that we have to understand that then only we have to move next right so she is she immediately said uh, what is here river nipa don't forget this market which river mentioned in this lesson nipa okay it the major river of europe it flows through russia okay yes so when if you come holidays you can enjoy this when they looked at the astrodrome astrodrome you know usually best all the best stop in the best stand right best stop then train junction similarly here also all the spaceship stop in this astrodrome that place is called astrodrome where uh, two spaceships the size of the austin kino see austin kino tv tower it's a very tall okay very height very tall tower okay nearly to touch the sky where pointed into the black void of the universe he she sighed again yeah there was a astrodrome okay by seeing he showed that space place so by seeing that um, spaceship and that astrodrome she wondered okay that much tall it is nearly this austin you know it's a tower in the um what's uh, like a radio tower you know like radio and tv it is in the moscow okay russia moscow is the capital of russia okay so tower by seeing that she wanted okay what are these she's asking okay what are these long range spaceship yeah he says it's a long it's a long journey spaceship okay uh through this only they they plan to move next planet mother they are planning an expedition to the neighboring galaxy yeah galaxy it's a collective noun okay stars galaxy is the collective noun yeah, so here he says yeah they planned in the spaceship only to move next galaxy like he said long range spaceship mother they are planning an expedition to the neighboring galaxy she screwed up screwed up shrink her eyes face and all okay it too far away so shrink kind to looking at that okay yeah screwed up her eyes to look at the rocket where assembly men were busy there you know it's too far away people were working okay assembling everything all the work is going on so she's looking at that okay shrink her eyes they looked quite small from a distance yeah it's quite pretty okay looking from the quite distance then she said quietly why should people go off into the unknown yeah um, why ask for trouble see nice question she asked so by seeing that people were working the smarter asking why these people are going go off this unknown planet okay why the people are going to unknown why they ask for trouble why they get into trouble get under trouble themselves so first you way first you enjoy yourself or first you study yourself where you are which planet you are so from the earth you went to moon right so first you stay there and to learn it you research there you study that moon completely see before that they plan to move another galaxy that's what she says why these people are moving to another 
galaxy why what for why they ask for trouble why they get into trouble like that the mother asks clear then these are very very reliable spaceship yeah so sun you know he say yeah it's a reliable safe and secure spaceship uh, you no need to worry okay like that yes, uh, her son says okay safe and secure uh, spaceship uh, nothing will happen uh, it's quite comfortable to ex for expedition everything these are reliable spaceship mother wouldn't it make more sense to settle properly on the moon first you see mother says wouldn't it make more sense settle properly on the moon first and then on the planet in the solar system before going further first you settle down there properly okay see the earth also we have to learn enjoy a lot right before that we moved in that another planet right moon so you you first study there you first settle down there before that why are you running why are you moving next uh, planet next star next galaxy like that this mother is asking okay first you settle down properly before that why are you jumping next planet fine it was now his turn to sign he couldn't tolerate okay if by mother's question he sighed sighed breath out okay then he, he couldn't manage okay you may be right but yeah he is adjusting yeah what you say is right but but what mother this replied okay but what how do i know like that he says yeah he longed to tell her about the flight he was longing for actually this spaceship you know expedition this is what his cup of tea okay he loved that very much so he struggled a lot to get this admission okay it's not quite easy task right so uh, he longed to tell her, see usually when we attend an interview or anything any any adventures or anything we tend to share with our parents or friends who were right uh, it's quite exciting moments but here he couldn't express with his mother all this ex excitement he had an interview he struggled a lot all these uh, uh, struggled moments and happiest moment also uh, he couldn't express it uh, properly with his mother because he was reluctant to make her worry okay she get beca because this is what the last call he knows very well that's what okay so longing for and about the nervous he had been yeah interview and all he get nervous right and confronted confront means face the election commission all this in interview and nervously he faced okay confronted but he checked himself checked meaning he stopped himself everything to share with her. Uh, her it was their last meeting before his departure so why spoil it so um, moreover above all this uh, it was the last uh, call okay talking to his mother so why should i spoil this moment if he express that definitely she get disappointed worry so he doesn't want okay that's why he didn't reveal that he reluctant to reveal that so uh, he just controlled himself and he was going on uh, talking listening her voice clear so i stop here please read this well and to learn this uh, hard words and notable important highlight the important words okay then the assignment already i gave the assignment you have to write in your own words the continuation okay finish that meet you in the next class thank you